What's going on, peeps? It's the Rototo, aka Rapapartoro. And um, <laughs> I wanted to do a video, uh, you know, using the Storm 4 gameplay. Uh, a lot of you guys were very vocal about how it's boring to watch the same gameplay over and over again. But I wanted to talk about something that I noticed in this Japan Expo gameplay. Um, they were getting people, like random people from the audience, to play the game, right? Because I was looking at their stream. And, um, yo, this game is really fast paced. Like, even with the round system, the game is really, really, really fast paced. And it looks like it accommodates players who are aggressive, okay? So, for those of you guys that were on Storm 3, that stopped playing, uh, you know, uh, Storm games because of Revolution, now you've got something to look forward to because your playstyle is actually accommodated in this game. The counters don't mean shit in this game. I mean, even even though the dudes were trying to counter, like each of them were trying to counter, they knew what the fuck they were doing either, too. Like they weren't like they weren't like just random motherfuckers that never played a storm game. They looked like they fucking knew what they were doing too, uh, and they were they were trying counters and shit, man. And I'm telling you, these counters were barely landing, all right? And I know a lot of people online, when they get their hands in the game, are going to actually be better than what I, what I saw in Japan Expo. But basically, like, you can tell that the, the counter itself is almost meaningless in this game. It's almost not even necessary, okay? Because, not only because, like, you get, you get cha like, your chakra bar taken away by just doing one of them, and they get no damage out of it, but... In general, bro, like, you can be aggressive as fuck and not worry about the counter because the game really seems to accommodate that, all right? I know I'm reiterating here, but I want you guys to understand how huge this is. And, and, and you know, uh, me as a YouTuber, I think that this game having a fast pace is also uh, beneficial for me because, obviously, you guys don't want to see long, drawn-out matches from me, right? Or from any other YouTuber. You guys want to see fast paced aggressive matches where you know everybody's just getting their ass kicked left and right you know really quick you don't want to fucking sit there and watch a match where you know we're running away with you know both of them both of the people that are fighting uh are running away throwing kunai and and basically you know making the game drawn out long and boring you know what i'm saying nobody wants that so now that i've seen i've seen the gameplay i've seen normal people play the game and then having seen how fast paced it is, I'm a little bit more reassured that the game's gonna be a lot better than Revolution. And, you know, I was scared because when they implemented the round system, I was like, oh my god, now the match is gonna last even longer. It's not gonna be that much fun to play, let alone watch. And, you know, that, that's never a good thing, guys. It's never a good thing. I prefer, like, you know, a two minute match, boom, as opposed to, like, me having to wait there five minutes, you know, fighting for five minutes. Uh, because, oh, okay, I, I get it, you know, sometimes you do need to draw out the battle a little longer because you don't want to make careless moves or decisions, but in this game, it doesn't seem to kind of conflict with that at all, you know? It seems to be almost like Storm 3 where you could be aggressive and yet not worry about the counter, right? Because like I said before, the counter doesn't seem to matter in this game at all. You can be aggressive. And, and it'll be rewarding as well. It, uh, you actually get hits off of it. You actually get damage. And I think that's awesome. I think that's that's amazing. Uh, now, on Storm 3, it was not as fast-paced as, as Storm 4 looks at the moment. Because, you know, there was a double guard that was running away, so on and so forth. I mean, you can still run away on, on Storm 4, mind you, yeah. And, and, and I'm pretty sure there are a lot of other things that might come in the way. Uh, of you actually finishing a matchup quickly because on the full game we're gonna have a lot more characters a lot more maps and that opens up a whole shit ton of fucking uh, 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 Variables which people can draw out the battle a lot longer for you know what I'm saying so hopefully though the game is how I imagine it and um, You know we, we get to see more stuff uh, along the way. Anyways guys. I'm out. Peace